Alrighty, today guys we are going to be doing a sway bar installation. Shouldn't be too hard, should be easy. I shouldn't even have to jack up my car, because technically, stock height bro. So, and then, uh, then we're gonna get to the springs. I might just leave it apart and then do the springs all at once, and then make it separate videos. What do you think, Lena? I like it. I like it, all right, she likes it. We got the the okay. So uh, I'm gonna quickly try to do this. I don't know how I don't know how long it's gonna take. Yes. Yeah. What would? What would? Oh, this would. The drawers? Probably. I haven't really talked that much this video just because I'm trying to honestly figure this out It's not hard to do. It's just a pain in the butt to get um, everything lined up and Perfectly squared so I think we're in a good spot where we can kind of explain what's going on um, It's pretty explanatory. I'm gonna link in a good installation video because I don't I don't want to call this an install how-to video um, because there's a, uh, I'm really bad at how to's. <laughs> it's not hard. I don't want to say it's hard. It's just a little difficult maneuvering with all this stuff in the way. Like if I dropped the lower control arm, life would be cake. I should have done, I should just do this all when I do the suspension. Um, like when I take out the rear springs, but um, I don't have enough time today and it it's supposed to rain for like the past couple hours so I'm trying to like quickly get this done I basically just take out the rear sway bar uh, put the bushings on the new one put the end links on the new one line them up loosely line it up and then um, tighten it all down <laughs> so I'm just gonna quickly do this and then we'll get we'll get rocking again Perfect timing. It just started raining, but uh, I was able to get. Let's see if you guys can see. Uh, sway bar is officially installed. I'm excited to see how it drives. I put it on the stiff setting because, uh, you know what I mean? Race car, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you can see it in there. It was kind of a pain in the butt to get in there, but it's done, it's tight, it's tuned, it's all that. And uh, I don't think I missed any bolts. I'm gonna get back to the other camera. All right, that's a success. We were able to finish the install. It wasn't didn't take me that long. Just uh, I just kind of took my time. Um, probably took me like maybe an hour, uh, including finding all my tools again and assembling. Uh, I, I take longer to find things than to actually work on the car. So it probably took me less time. But an easy install, just takes patience and manipulating it through the lower control arm and the exhaust. So I'm gonna go clean up, wash up, and then uh, we'll continue this video, do something. But I'm pumped, it was a success. Let's see if I can get a better shot of it. Yeah, so, as you can see, one thing, I scratched it up. I know it means no difference, but I did scratch it up a wee bit, like you see. It's in there. I'm super excited about it. Alrighty, absolutely perfect timing. Uh, I just cleaned up. The car is on the ground. I, try, I kind of want to take it for a drive just to see what it feels like, but at the same time, I want to make sure it's, I can uh, 
Let's try it out. Why, why can't I talk anymore? I don't know what happened to me. Stand this. I want to take it for a drive, but I'm going to wait until a dry day or even like probably tomorrow afternoon. Yeah, just when it dries up or even maybe later tonight. Um, but next is the suspension and that's probably going to happen this Saturday. Um, this weekend I'm going to kind of start playing around with uh, getting the front and rear suspension done. Um, so yeah, just poking at it, poking at it. Made some huge progress today on some, some, some uh, learning. I learned how to color grade better. I like sat down, I was like, you know what, instead of me, I always rush through learning programs and I sat down and like watched a 20 minute video on how to color correct. Even though I already have a basis, I just want to fine tune some color correction skills. Not, not so for these videos, but like uh, client videos. So I want to thank you for anyone that, uh, for everyone that uh, joined the live stream. I had so much fun just drawing, doodling, um, making the spaceship for the Porsche, for my buddy's Porsche, and um, yeah, I just pr I appreciate the support. It means a lot to me. I love the setup, the rig. I think I'm gonna go live more often. You know, just to kind of, as I'm doodling and kind of working on my skills, we can hang out and virtually just kick it. I said in the live stream, if there's anything, any suggestions for me to draw, so like, it doesn't need to be for anything, just uh, I love trying new things, so uh, different characters or even different cars. I like doing cars, but I, I love doing characters because they're hard, they're extremely hard. Both are hard, but <sighs> I'm starving. Enjoying, enjoying the state of life right now. We're, we're doing things. It's, uh, we got a lot going on, but super thankful and super happy to be in the position I am in. And uh, I hope you guys are all well and safe. Hopefully we can connect on the next live stream because I feel a lot more interactive than me when I post a video is fun, but when I'm live, it's there's something about it. It's like more interactive, obviously, but I enjoy it. I'll see you on the other side, bruh. All right, we're gonna do a little scootering with the lops real quick. Um, not gonna lie, tailwhip's gotten a lot better. I uh, haven't filmed much scootering because we've been, uh, I just kind of scooter at night with Lena. It's so much fun. That's just something we can both really enjoy. Yeah, dog. I'm pumped. I just realized tomorrow I actually have to go do some traveling. So I will absolutely be driving my car tomorrow and seeing what the new uh, sleigh bar voucher feels like. Why is this thing dark? Yeah, I'm pretty excited, man. Ready? First take, Timmy. Do a little, oh, you can't see, but. A little blunt, the feet. Oh my goodness. Really enjoyed it. I say, I don't even know if I said this in the other video. I ended up getting different size wheels. Um, made a huge difference in my whipping. Ever since I changed to 26 mil wide, I've gotten, uh, I locked some stuff down. I'm pumped, I didn't film it, but I actually landed a tail whip off this like four inch jump. I was pumped about it. That was about. Yes, sir. Yes. I didn't do it. <laughs> Red. Take some time, but you know the best thing? We know how to. Because if you're watching, me, me and my dad, we're not professional, but we know lots of tricks. Yeah, we do. Yeah. We're like the trick meisters. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Okay, right, so the second thing that I want to tell you guys, hop. um, I know how to do bunny hop, yeah. but Let's sometimes... See. Over here. Okay. Okay. I don't get why I can't always do that. Clean, right? Hop. Hop. <laughs> That's it. Clean. I don't know, I can never do it on but camera. But we're not done to hop, okay? Right. Let's do an outro. What? Okay guys, I'll say it for you. Um, have an awesome day, and I hope you're watching this video. It's the best, and we're still gonna show you everything that's up with you. Oh, sorry. Okay, we're gonna, sh we're gonna show you more, but if this dies, we're gonna do the peace out, okay? Okay, so, okay, let's get started before it dies.
wrong thing, you know? Oh. You gotta smack it. Ever?